Hey, welcome to another episode of geekoutdoors.com. So on this shotgun tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to add background color to your project and also some of the ways in which you can use a background color in your videos. And so the first thing we want to do is add our background color. So as you can see here, I already have a clip available. It's in its own track. So what I want to do is add our background color on a different track. So I'm going to do that by going here to the track, right click on my mouse, go to track operations and then add a video track. So now we have a new video track above the original track. So now let's go ahead and add our background color. I'll go here to open other, choose color, and the default is transparent, but you could also choose a preset of black as well. But in this case, I want a different color. I'm gonna go here to color. Let's choose red, I'll select that. Then I'll say, okay. So now we have our background color, but it's not yet in our project timeline. So in this case, you could drag it down to the track that you want, either this one or this one. I'm going to put it on the new video track. And there you go. We have our background color. And you could also change this color anytime that you want or add a custom color as well. So now that we have our background clip, it's very similar to any other clip. You can move this around. You can adjust the length of it. You could copy and paste it. You could also add filters on this clip. So in this case, let's go ahead and add some text above this background color. We'll go here to filters, go to the plus sign. Let's go ahead and add some text. And we'll go ahead and put in some text right here. And now we'll move it right here in the middle. And there is our background color with some text. So that's probably something that I think a lot of people would want to do. They just want to add a background color and put some text above it. So that's the first and simple example. Set up your business easily and legally with incredibly affordable rakes at Inkfowl. Join more than 500,000 businesses and launch your business today. For more information, check out the affiliate link in the description area below. And on the second example, let's just say that you want to actually add some background color above another clip. So in this case, I want a background color above this video clip. So I'm going to go ahead and choose this clip and I'm simply going to copy and I'm going to paste it. So now it's the same clip with the same background color and text. But in this case, I actually want this background color to still be there, but I also want there to be some visibility or transparency for the clip below it. So how would you do that? Well, all you have to do is choose this color clip and right click on your mouse and then go to properties. And now you go to the color properties, which we saw earlier. And so one of the things that you could do is obviously change the colors, but you could also change the opacity or transparency as well. So if you go to this plus sign, you notice that there is not only a color scale here and a color picker, but there's also a opacity or transparency scale. So right now it's at a full hundred percent, but if you decrease that, it'll become more transparent. So if you notice here, this is the level of transparent that you can see. So it's really solid if it's all the way to 100%. So if you move it to the left, it becomes more transparent. So I'm gonna go ahead and select this. And now you'll notice that it is transparent, but you still see some of the colors as well. So there it is. So you can see some red here, and obviously our text is still there above it. But what's nice about this is you can actually change the look or mood of a video with colors. And so let me go ahead and remove this text filter or just hide it for now so you can kind of see the difference. So let's go ahead and move this over here so you can see an example of how adding a transparent color background can make a difference. There it is. So in this case, it's not a colored background. It's more of a colored foreground, but you get the point. So by having this ability to add a colored background and also a colored foreground, you can actually add a little bit more variety to your videos. And at the same time, you know, you can do things like this, add text or any other filters that will actually improve your videos overall. So if you actually have any thoughts on this or any other ways in which you can use a color background, be sure to leave it in the comments area below. And if you did want to see more of my shotgun tutorials and tips, I do have an entire playlist. I'll leave that description area below. So as always, if you did get value out of these videos, be sure to share, like, and subscribe. And if you're a creative geek like me, 
and you want to get exclusive access to more content that I don't put out here publicly on my YouTube channel, then join my Goal Content Creators Group, where you're going to get content like this and more for all the creative geeks out there. And the best part is, all of this is free. Simply head over to the link below, check on the page, and sign up for my Goal Content Creators Group.